We are back here with Ed Doyle of Pima County Race Squad um, at the Roger Road Trot Sampler Club. So Ed's going to show us today uh, how they take the temperature sample from uh, reading from their trough. This is an indoor environment, um, a little bit more controlled. Um, so tell us about this, Ed. This trough is representative of the outfall and the upland flow of the outfall. They created it so for easier sampling, um, quicker time for us testing, for chlorine for us. And it's easier on the technicians to come to the trough and deliver our samples. So how would you take the temperature here? We take our temperature in the last baffle area, just the area that was set for everything else. So we place our temperature in the last baffle area up to the mark. And if you're good enough, you can read it while it's in there. So it's going to stabilize because it's in the water and it's constantly flowing, so it's going to be a constant temperature. We don't have to worry about it changing like at, at the alcohol. And so you also do duplicates at least once a week here? Yeah, we'll do a duplicate here. Using this thermometer, what you do is pull this thermometer out and you write the temperature down and use an aggression factor. We'll pull the thermometer down out and let it change so we can see that when we play it, it back in the effluent or we can see it rise or fall or whatever and we can see it change. And I see you have your records here. Um, so you write this down immediately? Or? Immediately, yeah. Just so, yeah, remember, yeah. But we write this down right away. Well, just serve that sheet here. And as soon as we see our temperature, then we'll write it down. And then we'll do a loop again. Okay. And write it down. And so now you can read the... Yeah, it's stabilized pretty good. We can read it. And I'm seeing a, a 28A. So it's got a correction factor of neg minus 0.3. So we would call it a 28.5. Okay. That's what we call it for today. Okay, thank you. Adam. You're welcome.